Okay, Jason here again with another video for EEM 171 codes and installations. And here we're going to actually make our threads on the RMC conduit. Okay, so I have my, all my tools ready to go here on the vise. And I've actually moved the vise so that it's pushing against the wire containers here to prevent the vise from moving around because um, you really have to push into the conduit to make the threads at, at least initially so um, if you can find something to push the vise against or have somebody help hold the vise for you that'll help you out a lot okay one thing also before you start if you would Grab one of the trash cans and throw the thread on the ground while you're doing it. And place that underneath where you're going to be making the threads. Okay. And that will catch a lot of the metal shavings and also the oil. And it'll save you a lot of cleanup work at the end. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to take my threader, I'm going to slide the conduit in from this side, okay, and thread it until the conduit reaches this side, okay. Slide them like that. Make sure the ratchet is going in the right direction, which will be clockwise. Okay. I'm going to need to move you because I am right handed. So I'm going to have to put you over here. Okay. There we go. So, what I'm going to do here is take my left hand and push in to the threader while operating the ratchet with my right hand, okay? So the hardest part is getting this started. You really have to push into it to get the first few threads going. Alright, so now I have the first few threads going in. I don't know if you'll be able to see this or not. Okay, so I have cut the first few threads. So that's the hardest part. So once you've got that 
it'll pretty much do the work on its own. So from this point on, I want to keep some oil on it. Maybe. Keep some oil on there. Okay. And now I can just let it go. She's using the ratchet. Okay, so after a few turns, it's good to clean off the threads. So reverse it. Okay. So those metal shavings can build up and damage the cutter if you don't keep it cleaned out. So go forward a few more and reverse it. You can tell when they fall out. Just occasionally add some oil. And you want it to be where the threads are even with the other end. Of the threader. As you can see right there. So once they're at that edge, you've gone far enough. So now you just reverse the threader and you're done.
good. And then if all goes well, that should thread in to any type of RMC connector. And I was hoping I had one to show you. Just a coupling to go from one conduit to the other. It's like that. Okay. So that is your thread. So after that, you're gonna after you get your first one, take your tape measure, measure about three inches, cut it off. Then do another thread, just like this one, and measure it, cut it off at three inches as well, okay? And if you're not sure how to do that, look at the other video where we discuss using the pipe gutter, okay? So that's how you thread RMC conduit, and that's all for now.